hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel with another useful and informative video which is about how to fix your payment not completed in your app store so as if you are trying to install or download apps in your device and you are facing this problem in your app store here i will show you how can you fix it so as you will have to simply watch this video till the end to fix this problem so let's first of all go back to your home screen and here i will give you some possible solutions to fix this problem in your device so first of all open up your settings in your device and from here scroll it below and tap on screen time and from here scroll it below and tap on content and privacy restrictions and from here tap on itunes and app store purchases so as you will have to simply allow installing apps from here and then you will have to allow in-app purchases from here so after this check if the problem is fixed or not so after this go for the other solution if you are still facing this problem that is you will have to scroll it below in your settings and from here you will have to tap on face id and passcode enter your passcode and from here you will have to simply turn this toggle off for itunes and app store so i turn this toggle off for itunes and app store and don't use your face id or your touch id to install apps in your itunes and app store so after this check if the problem is fixed or not and if you are still facing this problem then go for the other solution that is you will have to scroll it below and you will have to open your app store from here so from here you will have to simply scroll it below and you will have to turn all these toggles on so i turn on the toggle for app downloads and app updates and in-app content and all of these toggles turned on so after turning them on go back and check if the problem is fixed or not so if you are still facing this problem then go for the other solution that is you will have to open your apple id and from here you will have to scroll it below and then you will have to simply sign out your apple id in your device and then you will have to restart your device and then you will have to sign back again your apple id in your device so i do this and check if the problem is fixed or not so guys if you are still facing this problem then you will have to simply contact apple support for more information and help so that hopefully after all the solutions your problem will be fixed so i thank you for watching this video if you find this video helpful please like and subscribe to my youtube channel as well thank you